Hey guys, it is Spicy Blocks here, and today, folks, we're taking a look at Kaneto Kitten is taking a break from YouTube. Oh my goodness! Well, stay at the very end of this video so you can find out all the information of what's going on. But before we dive right into today's exciting video, I do I know we're gonna be doing videos just like this one all the time. So make sure to smash that like button and subscribe button. Comment down below your favorite thing about Kaneto Kitten. With that out of the way, let's go ahead and jump right into today's exciting video. No, I'm not quitting YouTube. It'll be happening for a little bit, and why I've decided to take this break. For starters, now, if you guys don't know who Kaneto Kitten is, Kaneto Kitten is a Roblox YouTuber who has over 1.3 million subscribers. Kaneto Kitten's been on the platform for quite some time, although he's not been in popularity since probably around 2020 when he actually started blowing up. He actually started with a lot of Roblox gameplay videos, and what really took his channel off was whenever he switched over to more of a generalized talking channel, where essentially it was more of a drama channel, but he tried not to focus too much on drama because it brought in a lot of negativity, which is is what he did not want. But pretty much his channel is talking about everything within Roblox, just if there was issues with Roblox, he would bring them up and let people know. Or if there was some issues going on with some YouTubers or people like Dennis leaving the community, he would actually talk about that and bring it up and put his thoughts on it and what he thought about the issues going on in the community. And since he has such a passion for Roblox and absolutely loves it, his goal is pretty much to put forth the real issues forward and try to help Roblox build the platform better and better, as he absolutely loves it and wants to see it grow and become something special. But because of the fact that there is so many issues with Roblox, he has to put his thoughts and opinions out there to make sure people know what is truth and what is not. Although he tries to steer clear of drama, he does focus on some drama here and there when it is necessary. Currently, Kaneto Kitten has been doing videos non-stop since 2018. Yes, that is right, daily content since 2018, that is quite a long time. And as of right now, Kaneto Kitten has pretty much stated that he needs a break. Straight up, no putting anything forward, just flat out he needs a break because he's burnt out. He's not quitting YouTube or Roblox, he absolutely loves it as he stated, it's just that he needs a break. He is completely burnt out and he does not know what else to do, it's just the fact that his content he's putting out he does not feel proud of and he feels like it's it's just meh. It doesn't feel like it's anything special or what he actually wants to post. So he's going to be taking a break. He also mentioned that he is moving out right now and it's really hard to juggle him trying to do daily uploads with him moving out to his new house and his secondary channel which he's uploading on. It's just a lot to juggle and he can't really take all of it at once. Are you swearing there? Nah, but I've actually been running this series so far called Curious Cat. Where I so, what is he going to go ahead and do? He pretty much stated that he's going to be quitting his main channel for time being, just not permanently, just to take a break. And he's pretty much going to move over to his secondary channel for the time being, where he's just going to upload here and there. That channel is based off of just answering questions people have in the community, whether it may be something around Coral or something of that nature. Just any questions someone has, he might do a video on it. And it's not really consistent content. Also, he does swear on that channel, so if you're not a liking to that, make sure to stay away from it, but that is pretty much what he's going to be doing from here on out. He said that he doesn't know exactly when he's going to come back just yet, though he is just going to tell us whenever he comes back. It may be one week, two weeks, or maybe even up to a month. Honestly, I don't see him leaving for an entire month. I think he probably will be gone for roughly three weeks until he comes back, but that's just my rough estimate. This time though, it's not like catalog heaven, because like when people were where people were doing the catalog I just like this. My last point I do want to make is the fact that I've been noticing more and more YouTubers like Leah Ash, Zachary Zaxor, and Inquisitor Master taking breaks on the YouTube platform. Now there's nothing wrong with breaks. Honestly, breaks help people keep going and not get burnt out. But when it's a lot happening at once, it's really concerning for the platform because all I can see is people actually just having a problems with the platform itself. There must be an issue in Roblox, and that biggest issue is the fact that there's not enough games on the platform that are enjoyable or different. It seems to be just more copy and paste. Today's the start of my break, so I'm going to enjoy it. Catch yourselves well, stay real, and as always- But that is our video on Kaneto Kitten taking a break. What are your thoughts? Please let me know in the comment section down below, and if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe button, and we'll see you in another amazing video. Bye-bye, guys.